meth, typically what we see, as far as the mess on the meth seizures, um, is typically in a vehicle environment is what we're seeing. You know, from time to time we'll see it in the passenger, and obviously they're in lower weights when they come across in a pedestrian or a passenger has it on them. It's a broad spectrum of individuals. We have teenagers, we have juveniles coming in that, that are carrying at times meth on their body. Typically is what we see on the juveniles walking across, strapped to them in their, you know, their ad, abdomen section, their midsection, strapped to their thighs. So we'll see males, we'll see females, we'll see family units um, of all ages coming in um, with meth in the vehicles. Meth, um, because it's going to come across in a smaller quantity and it's going, to become, it's, it's going to be in a deeper concealment of the vehicle. So in all likelihood, we're going to have to really look for it to find it. What we noticed in those type of seizures is obviously it still gives a scent. There's an odor. As long as that odor is available, our canine units are trained to hit on that odor.